Hey guys, so today we're gonna do a Christmas look. Uh, a look you could wear around the holidays or if you celebrate Christmas, you can wear this. Um, for any family function around Christmas, uh, so without further ado, let's get on to the video. I've already done, um, I've already done all my face makeup, so most of it, so, what the main part of the tutorial is, is eyeshadow. So, I like to use a lot of different like eyeshadows in one look. And so what I'm going for today is a little bit of a natural eye, but a little bit smoky and a little bit of glitter, like a little bit of shimmer. So we're going to do a nice basic crease of colors. I like to use more than one color. Put it all in the crease. I like to put it like on the lid of my eye as well. It's all going to get blended. And this is just the first color we're putting down. I like to blend it really in here. Just blend it. But you could go with. If you don't really like warm tone, you can do dual tone mops. But, like for me, I like warm tone. So I'll put that like kind of in the crease, but more at the end of your eye lid. And blend that. Okay, <clears throat> and then now we can get another brush and start doing the darkness part. I like to add a lot of different colors. So I get that perfect brown. But you don't have to use the same products I'm using. Um, there's definitely other products out there that look the same. So I'm just messily like putting this in the where we put the last color I'm basically putting it there in the outer corner but like mostly just like not particularly putting it in a specific spot but just putting it out and then and we're gonna go in with a shimmery color so it won't matter. Brown. Okay. Make sure that's blended with the other colors you have put down. And then go back in with color start and then get another blending brush that is clean and blend on the set and if you feel like your darker color went away then add a little bit more and then a little bit more of this darker brown but not too intense because we want it a little bit smoky but 
not kids because they're gonna be around like family members and such and we don't want to look too crazy but I say do what you want because your eyeshadow is your number one okay into the sugary color which I'm excited about Need another brush like champagne color that was in the Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette and so we're just gonna put that in the inner part of the eyelid and then we go with a little bit of the darker color we put down in the blender so it doesn't look so choppy we don't want choppy eyeshadow and then I'm going to go back in with like the orange color we put in just so we don't lose it If you want it more intense, go in with your finger and just put it down more. So might be a little bit too intense right now, so blend it all in. So I did my um so I did my top eyeliner and mascara off camera so we are going to do the finishing touches now we're going to go back in with that champagne color we used for our lid and in the inner corner put the champagne color so our inner corners are mine so that just opens up your eye so much more. Last finishing touch is some lipstick. To put the lip together. And if you want, you could do a red lip for Christmas. In my opinion, I would rather wear nude because it goes with the look. And it just makes it a little bit more cohesive. That's pretty much it for the look. And so I will show you lips that will go with this look that you could wear for Christmas for any kind of Christmas event you have, a Christmas party, um, a work Christmas party, or a party with your family for Christmas. So I hope you like this and let's, let's move on to the outfit looks. So for outfit number one is a very casual option to wear for Christmas. It is paired with a green shirt and a jacket with jeans and boots. And you can dress it up or dress it down. So outfit number two, I paired a velvety tank top with the same jacket as in outfit number one. And I paired it with black pants and open-toed heels to make it a more dressier outfit for any Christmas function you may have. Outfit number three is a velvet jumpsuit with a leather jacket and I also paired the same heels as in outfit number two and this is a casual yet dressy look and it is also comfortable but you'll seem more put together in this outfit and I also paired it with a simple necklace so it won't distract you from the blue velvet jumpsuit you have on so this is my makeup and outfit look ideas for Christmas or even for any holiday party you may have. I hope you liked this video and thank you for watching.